Hello everyone, I hope you're all doing well. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make these pretty and cute hair balls. So if you want to learn how you can make them as well, keep on watching! So as always, we first start with the materials that you're going to need. I cut my ribbon in 6 pieces and here are the measurements that you're going to need. So the first thing that we have to do is to take our piece of ribbon and fold it in the middle like this. I actually already showed you a very similar technique, so it's not uh, something entirely new. And then we're gonna fold it again in half so you can have a triangle on the top and we have to pin it. And now we just have to do the same thing with all the rest of the pieces. And here we have to have six pieces pinned. And now we're going to form the ball. Uh, we have to take our first piece and we're going to need as well needle and thread. And we have to start sewing the piece until the middle. And this is important step because we are going to add there the next piece. So we have to take the second piece of uh, ribbon and place it in the middle behind the first piece as you can see here and then we have to sew it uh, together And here is important to not sew everything until the end because right here we are going to add the third piece and we are going to place it right next to the first one so the second piece of ribbon stays behind. And then we have to sew everything together until uh, the end of the second uh, piece. So when we finish sewing everything together, uh, we just formed the first part of the bow and as you can see the second part of the ribbon stayed behind. And now the next step is to form the other side of the bow and to do that we have to do exactly the same as what we did with uh, the first half of the ribbon. And I'm gonna speed it up a little bit so it does not get too long. And here now when we sew everything on the same thread, I forgot to mention that, but uh, you can see it clearly. So now we just have to pull the thread carefully. So now we just have to sew through the left side of the bow so we can connect the both pieces together and pull uh, the thread very carefully. And after that we just have to make few knots so we can secure the bow well. Now the next step is to place a piece of ribbon in the middle of the bow and since I don't have a thinner ribbon from the same type, I'm just gonna use a little piece of the same ribbon and I'm just gonna fold it and secure it with the glue. And now to attach the piece of ribbon we just have to put a little bit of a hot glue and place it in the middle. Thank you. 
So now to finish the bow I'm just gonna use a hair clip or they're called uh, barrettes as well. You can find them online or in any craft store I think. So now I'm just going to use a little bit of a hot glue so I can attach the hair clip on the back of the bow. I think I didn't use enough uh, hot glue but still you can use as much as you want. And here I'm just putting a little bit more glue in the middle of the hair clip so I can attach the both ends of the ribbon. And this is going to take a little bit of a time until you arrange it well, but we're almost done with the bow. So now our beautiful bow is ready. I hope you liked this video. If you did, please subscribe for more videos like this. And again, as always, I wish you all the best and see you next time. Bye!